Hi everyone, uh, Inlinx has just added the ability to add um, content plans directly into the chat GPT um, system that's just come on. If you haven't used the system, um, go over to chat.openai.com, openai.com. Absolutely incredible. You just type some words in and it creates lots of content and it's very, very interesting. Um, it's not something we're going to try and compete with, but let's show you how it's done and how you can easily um, make use of it if you want to, if you feel that automating your content writing or speeding up your content writing is something that you really want to do. So this is a site that I've uh, I've got for um, predicting things uh, and uh, I've created a, a content brief called How to Make Money from FX Trading. So if I go and have a look at that content brief now, and it's also in audits as well um this uh, this this um keyword research goes on in the background but after about a minute it comes up with the content plan here and this is where you'll find this button here called chat chat gpt prompt might change the name of that a little bit and give it a space or something like that but what it's done is it's taken the um the content plan and it's changed it into something that is going to make it really um, useful to just cut and paste straight into chat, chat G, GTP. So we already know um, more than um, than an, an, an NLP API or chat API is going to know about what we should be talking about. So we should be able to give better instructions than um, than if you just put um, the the how to the, the phrase how to make uh, money from FX trading into uh, into Chat GBT. So you could just put that into uh, into here, and off it would go, and it would start making some content for you. But we found that it's much better if you go and say right. Well, you could just copy all this. So we've got write an article about how to make money from FX trading. Start with the title and introduction. Use less than 300 words uh, and then uh, use these kind of words and then have a section about trading, then about beginners, then about scams, firms, traders, forex market. And you can have all of these. Now you can copy all of this and put all of that in as once. But we found that if you I was prepared to spend just a few minutes writing some stuff and do it one section at a time, uh, then uh, the chat GPT uh, actually comes out with better stuff. So let me put that one in there. And it's going to create uh, the first part of the content. Uh, how do I make money from FX trading? Uh, and uh, it's going to give me probably about 300 words on on uh, an introduction. But then whilst it's doing that, I can go over there and connect, collect the, the next section. I want to then go and have a section about trading. In, uh, and, and what it does there is let me go down here and let it finish. So chat GPT does have a uh, you know, a throttle. So if you try and put too much in too fast, it's going to have an issue. But now look, it's come up with a section name. So now it's saying tra trading in the Forex market. So now it's understood that it's talking about trading in the context of the Forex market. And it's now bringing in the main topics for this section. That'll include some of the things that we've already talked about, whether it's, you know, some of the, if the words Forex marketing is market is coming in uh, within this content. Um, but it's now contained within this section uh, and then go to the uh, to the next section here um uh, sorry that's the uh, that's the one i started at the beginning of the video so now I'll just have the the beginner section let's have a look at the beginner section and see what it's coming up with um and see uh see if that's uh working well so now we've got beginners in the forex market so it's understood the relationship uh, and now it's talking about for beginners in the context of the forex market so it's taking these entities and seeing the relationship and continuing the conversation it's a chat api it's designed to carry on with the conversation so you can ask it to add a section uh, and we've done all the uh, the formatting of that for you so now you've got this really good um section here and this stuff and you can just uh, go in there if you like it please tell them that uh, that you like it they're trying to to, to learn here uh, and you can uh, then just you know take that um, that content section by section uh, and uh, and put it straight into your editor over here uh, and take all of those sections uh, and uh, and put them in here and as you're doing that the uh, the content score on the right hand side is going to uh, to add up so we've got the section here And you can see how very quickly we're going to get a very, very, um, uh, very good um, article on trading in the forex market. Uh, and as you write these, uh, these, 
um, topics in there and the content comes in, it sees that you're picking up the main entities that you need to talk about. So we can sit there and say, right, what does it mean by trade? And we can, of course, see the underlying entities of trades for those that haven't used inlinks before. These are the synonyms that really all mean the same thing. Uh, this is the Wikipedia um, link for the underlying entity of uh, trade in the context of trading. And these are related entities to trading. Uh, so you can uh, see that it's bringing it up and it's uh, improving the score of the, of the underlying content from an SEO point of view. Uh, and what we've done by doing this is, uh, is allowed you to take the sections that you think are important, put them straight into GPT in a way that's formatted it's not uh you know it's it's a we'd already written all of this uh this this idea of understanding what to write um it's just uh chat gbt you know you might as well ask chat gbt to speed it up if that's your thing if you don't want to do that then uh hopefully by the time we go live there'll also be a plus here and you can do what you did before and you can add the sections straight into your um plans you can add all these instructions straight into your editor uh for a uh, for a human being to to then um follow those instructions as well so I hope you like it. Um, it's still got all the keyword research and all the other bits and pieces that you had before. It's just that for those that want to use ChatGPT, we've made it so that in links is content with ChatGPT will hopefully be stronger than ChatGPT on its own. Tell us if you like it. Tell us if you think it's going to work.